So once again, I am here at RE Plus. This is where a lot of manufacturers introduce right, so. and showcase their new products that are coming out in the following year. And I'm gonna go take you to a booth that I think everybody might be interested in. So right now I am at the Solark booth and Solark has just came out with a brand new residential inverter. You guys are probably familiar with their 15K inverter. They've now come out with an 18K inverter. It's, and it looks identical. The only thing difference is on the outside, it's two inches taller. So now this inverter can output a continuous 18,000 watts, continuous. Now that's day or night, 18,000 watts that it can output straight off of the battery, no solar. And uh, the way they do that is they have in here, they've got a 350 amp breaker. They're bringing in parallel four aught battery cables from your 48 volt batteries. And those parallel four aughts are enough to produce 18,000 watts of power. And this do, does have the 200 amp pass through, bring 200 amps in, 200 amps out. Got the generator port. Now the generator port is a smart port. So you can use it for a generator. You can use it as a smart load. And you can also use it to bring in an AC coupled solar power system into the unit and even add more wattage to it. Now, as we look inside again, you can see right here in the middle, this is your charge controller. It has three MPPT charge controllers. These are meant to be paralleled because this can utilize up to over 28,000 watts of solar. Utilize, it can use up to 28,000 watts of solar. I think you can put somewhere over 30,000 watts of solar onto this system, but it can only use just over 28,000 watts. It also claims to surge up to 38,000 watts for up to 10 seconds. And that should be able to start any of your, you know, air conditioners, compressors, motors, well pumps, stuff like that. Definitely has a really high surge capability. Now, as we look in here, you've got your ground bar here. They've moved the neutral bar up and down. They turned it sideways so that it was easier to bring your cables in and land the neutral bar. That's the only real big change on the inside. And then the screen, if you guys are familiar with the Solarks, the screen is pretty much the exact same programming as before. Now this inverter will be EMP hardened. That will be an option just like the other ones. And I know a lot of people like the Solarks because of the EMP hardening, but this is definitely something people is gonna be interested in because if you're stacking inverters to try to meet your power requirements, now you can get 18,000 watts out of just one unit. And then when you run just one unit, you have a fast transfer time It'll be faster than using one of the uh, microgrid interconnect devices or paralleling inverters. Um, from my understanding, that will slow down the reaction time uh, when you have a power outage, how quick it switches over. If you parallel an inverter, that will slow down that where it disconnects from the grid and reconnects. The, the blip will get a little bit longer when you parallel inverters or use the microgrid device. But on this, you can have 18,000 watts of output and still keep a really low uh, delay, a really low time on the time it is to switch over during a power outage. But there you go, folks. This is the new 18K from Solark. So this will be coming out sometime next year. And I think the price point they were saying, we don't know what the price point is for sure, but it's gonna be somewhere close to 8,000, I think is what it is. So let's have to wait and see.